detection of carbohydrates starch fats and proteins in the given food compound test for carbohydrates we have four tests for detecting carbohydrates in the given food compound molis test take the given food compound in a clean and dry test tube and add few ml of distilled water now add 2 drops of molish reagent After that, add concentrated H2SO4 slowly along the side of the test tube. Formation of violet color ring at the junction of two layers indicates the presence of carbohydrates in the given food compound failing test take few ml of failing solution a and few ml of failing solution b in a test tube and then add aqua solution of the given food compound to it Heat the contents for about two minutes on a water bath. Formation of a brick red precipitate of cuprous oxide indicates the presence of carbohydrates in the given food compound. Benedict's test. To the aqueous solution of the food compound, add. few drops of benedict reagent Heat it on a water bath. Formation of red precipitate of copper oxide indicates the presence of carbohydrates in the given food compound. Tollens test. Prepare aqueous solution of the given food compound and leave it aside. Take few ml of freshly prepared 2% silver nitrate solution and add two drops of sodium hydroxide solution to it.
dark brown precipitate of silver oxide appears. Then dissolve the precipitate by adding ammonium hydroxide solution. a solution of the given food compound to it. And heat the reaction mixture on a water bath for 5 minutes. After 5 minutes, formation of silver deposits on the inner side of the test tube indicates the presence of carbohydrates in the given food compound. Test for starch Test for starch is also known as iodine test. Take small amount of given food compound and add few drops of distilled water. an aqueous colloidal solution of the food compound. Now add few drops of iodine. Appearance of blue color indicates the presence of starch in the given food compound. Test for fats. Take the given food compound in a clean dry test tube and add few crystals of potassium hydrogen sulfate. contents of test tube on a water bath. Evolution of pungent smell confirms the presence of oil and fat in the given food compound. Test for proteins. Take 3 ml of egg albumin in a clean dry test tube and add few drops of distilled water. drops of sodium hydroxide solution and few drops of copper sulfate solution as well. Now heat the contents of test tube gently. Appearance of violet color indicates the presence of proteins. 